Hello, Carl here with Sustainability Theory News. We're over at inspirationgreen.com and they got a great article here on pit greenhouses. Now, earth-based greenhouses or partially buried greenhouses are great because they retain a lot of heat from the earth. Now, this is a wallapini, I believe I'm pronouncing that right, over in Bolivia. Note the uh, slanted walls. Little extra for stability there. You only need to get about four or five feet below now. In uh, Bolivia, they're about 13,000 feet above sea level. And here's a video that I'm going to link to as well in a subreddit that show explains the Wallapini and the people's dilemma growing in high altitudes with erratic temperature swings and weather. But underground greenhouses are great options. And there's some good ideas here if you want to build your own. You want to have a cold sink in here to uh, regulate temperature, shoring and polyethylene for sealing the little topsoil growing bed. And there's another idea here with gravel and yet another idea here with earth bags and then putting poly around to seal it and then having a rubble trench and six mil poly between the, the gravel layer and the outside earth. There's all sorts of different options here. And here's a basic earth sun pit. So you build the shelves right into it. Easy working. And then a, a half built little pit with a solar frame that's just half buried a couple feet off the ground and then some propagation trait great ideas there are some great ideas in this article i'm going to link to this in the description of course and if you'd like to see more news headlines like this subscribe to my channel have a great day